about the printing of ballot papers and the concerns raised about those papers is a matter that must be cleared. I say so because IBC is supposed to give Kenyans the confidence that they are in charge of the process. Uh, the allegations made against Senator Wetangula or others, they should clear them. They should say so clearly as to whether there was any influence, etc., etc. The questions raised as to the question or, uh, on the issue of uh, the register must be sorted. Chebukati must tell Kenyans, give a press briefing every day if possible for the next 30 days so that Kenyans can have the confidence that this election will be free, fair, simple and accurate. Uh, the noise is not helpful. Uh, Kenyans are soon going to lose confidence in IBC. And the risk of losing confidence in IEBC is that there will be something called voter apathy. There was apathy about registration. There's going to be vo apathy about voting if IEBC is not clear about the issues concerning the credibility of our elections. And some of these issues should not dra be dragged into the political circles because IEBC ought to be able to, to, to tackle these issues before they become political discussion, because when they become political discussions, you can never tell who is telling the truth. But the last word and the final word without prompting should come from Wilfred Chebukati about uh, the elections. So Mr. Chebukati, please stand up for the elections of 2022. You have less than 30 days to give us a credible election. We will blame you as a country if there's any problem with this election, because we have told you in advance that you must give Kenyans the confidence they require that you are in charge of our elections.